Yo, what up everybody? Welcome. It's time for the first eBay break of the day. We're going to be doing 2018 Top Series 1 Baseball Hobby Edition. Half case break number 2. Stuff just came out yesterday. Real nice stuff in here. We are looking for short prints in this deal. Uh, there's only about a relic or an auto per box in this. So it's uh, definitely uh, tough to get an auto. Alright. We did a half case of this yesterday. So this is the other half of it. And uh, in the first half there was only one autograph. And five relics. So, uh, in my mind, I get the feeling that this half is going to be a little bit more autograph heavy. But uh, that's what we're here to find out. <sighs> oh, yeah. And as always, good luck, everybody. <laughs> Thank you, Abe. All right. So this is how I'm going to rock this thing. Alright, everyone. What I'm going to be doing is, because these short prints are incredibly difficult to find. I mean, it's not incredibly difficult. But I would definitely have to go card by card. To see what's a short print. So, if you catch it, cool. Let me know. Otherwise, I'm just going to separate the rookies and everything else. To make my uh, my sort of life a little bit easier. Uh, well, in yesterday's break, the Reds did really nice. There was a Barry Larkin uh, autograph numbered to five. It was actually pretty sweet. Uh, I think I got a picture of it, actually. Um, like I said, real nice. Real, real nice. Actually, I do have a picture of it. Here it is. You know, picture doesn't really do it that much justice. I wish I had it in person to show you. But, uh, yes. There are real nice stuff available in it. Now, uh, let's begin this journey here. So, like I said, yesterday it took way too long to do this. Mainly because I was looking for short prints on, like, everything and all that shit. So this one is going to be a lot faster for me. I'm just going to separate rookies and everything else. If I catch a short print, cool. Otherwise, I'm going to keep it moving on this peeps because uh, this takes a this takes a long time to do. And not to mention, you guys, this is only a half case break. However, on our website, we got a full case break of this stuff, all right? And uh, not to mention, if you buy a team in the store break, I'm going to give you a hobby exclusive Series 1 silver pack with your team purchase only at RipCityCards.com. These silver packs are not being given away on eBay, all right? Only for our website, RipCityCards.com. I got to give you a reason to go in there. And not to mention, you also save $15 off of your website purchase. Status Baseball is down, I'm sorry, Series 1 Baseball is down to 24 teams. Once all teams are gone, I will rip that thing. So, uh, help a brother out. As I continue to open this. Well, that's not good. Well, I already see the patch. Spoiler alert for the Yankees.
So who's in this break? If you are, let me know. Tell me what teams you got, because it is good mojo. And hopefully we can uh, speak it into existence. Dan got the Royals, Orioles, and the Nats. Any specific player look you're looking for, Dan? Bryson up in this thing too. Mariners, Rockies, and the A's. baby for those of you guys in this break check out the full case break we have in the store guys don't forget you save fifteen dollars on your first purchase all you got to do is register for an account the code will get emailed to you and for buying a team i'm giving away the hobby exclusive silver packs with your purchase only at ripcitycards.com all right but uh let's see what's in this ebay All right, well, what I'm going to do is I'm going to separate what I consider base. These are inserts, so I'm going to put those aside. This is an insert. Is it a short print? It is. Eric Davis of the Reds. I was told if it ends in 43, 44, or 45, it's a, probably a short print. But there's that. Uh, by the way, spoiler alert, there was a Gary Sanchez patch in here. It kind of just slipped out, and I caught it, and there it is. I figured, why wait? Let me just show it now. So for the Yankees, two-color patch right there for him. Some inserts here. This is the pain in the ass. Well, the rookies have to be separate. The pain in the ass is, as you can see, some of the cards aren't even, like, right side up. So that's a little annoying. But the cards are definitely cool looking. I like them. In this set, it's all about the variations. Foil for uh, Felipe Rivero of the Pirates. It's a rookie. If you guys see a short print, let me know. Some of you guys have seen way more of this than I have. So if you do if you do catch a, a short print, let me know. And I'll pull it out. That's what she said. Nothing there. No. These go here. These are all inserts. All right. Try to keep everything more or less in line or something. I don't know. So these are there. This is a rookie. Both rookies. So rookies are going here. Inserts. Roy Halliday of the Phillies. I was getting old real quick already. Having to flip the cards right side up and stuff. Inserts. The Mankata Future Star insert. Right. 
вот All right, guys, we are watching this, and I know it is a, a tough, tough thing to watch, so bear with me. Like I said, if you guys catch any short prints, let me know, dudes, because the only way I know they're short prints is by looking at the, uh, the back of the card and seeing that small number right there where my, my finger's at right here. And just quite honestly, it's going to take way too much time. We are running on a schedule here. So I want to get through it. Uh, what I am separating, though, I'm separating what I believe to be the base set. There's probably short prints in there. Uh, but I'm making my, my sorter's life a little easier. Which ensures that this goes out in a timely fashion. So I'm separating the base, inserts, and rookies. Uh, like I said, to make my sorter's life a little easier. But if I cap it, if I happen to catch one that is a short print, I'll definitely pull it out. Because that's what she said. That's a rookie. You think the Mankata was numbered? Yeah, you see what I'm saying? That's why this stuff takes forever. This bad boy right here? Yeah, I probably should have caught that. I think it is numbered. And it's not, though. It's not. It's a regular base card. And that is why I do what I do. And I just separate the inserts, rookies, and what I believe to be the base set. And then my sorters can go through it because, you know, it's really difficult to tell whether it's a short print or not unless you actually know for a fact. The, there was no numbering on the Mankata, uh, unless I missed it. I don't see any numbering on this Mankata. Ah, uh, Dan. Mm, I see what you did there. I see what you did there. Nope, uh, no numbering on this thing. Oh, you mean that? The number to 2018? Wow. What the fuck kind of numbering is that? Holy shit. I ain't never in my life seen nothing like that. Well, no wonder I missed it. Usually when it it's, when it's numbered, it, it'll pop up a little bit. It'll be like a gold or like a silver or something. God damn it. That is fucking terrible. That is fucking terrible. Jesus Christ. That is just, that is just bad. See, all you old dudes that collect stuff, y'all know about that. Your boy don't know shit. So I do appreciate y'all helping me out. But you know what? In the interest of time, I can't go back and forth, guys. I, I really can't. This stuff takes way too long. So, like, this is a, apparently it's a short print. Joey Votto of the Reds. I would have to look at that little ass number down there. You can't see it in the camera because of the focus. But if it ends in 43, 44, 45, uh, it's supposed to be a short print, according to what I'm hearing on the streets. I should have caught that gold. I, I knew it was a funky one. But I really, how, man, thank you guys for letting me know that was uh, numbered. Because I would not have caught that that numbering on that. You 
Now, I, I can't, I really want to check everything, but. Psh. Six boxes took me two hours last night. That's not going to cut it. That is just not going to cut it. So many variations. It's kind of kind of ridiculous. Although I do dig it. I do dig it. I am not going to lie. It gives you a reason to like, you know what I mean? To, to really do your research and get into the nitty gritty of this. Ah, uh, Dan, good try. I mean, it's not like I was gonna. Hold, it's not like I was gonna keep this stuff anyway. It's, you know what I'm saying? It's gonna go to whoever it belongs to. I guess they just. Well, this I have to random. I guess they would just get the 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 benefit of seeing me sleeve it on air like this. Oh my God, he sleeved it. Oh yeah. But I mean, it's gonna get. It was gonna get sleeved regardless. You know. That's what my sorters do, baby. That's what we pay them for anyway. A foil for Mike Fears or Fires or the Astros. I'll give you a foil pack though if you buy into the full case break in our store. RipCityCards.com. Save yourself $15 on your first purchase by registering for an account. And if you buy a team in Series 1 PYT, I will give you a silver pack from 2018 Top Series 1 Hobby. With your team purchase, uh, just like that, no questions asked. You know that's what we pay him for. We got to put the sorters to work. Y'all want me to sort through shit while I'm breaking it? Yeah, that's not gonna happen. But like I said, if you catch a short print or something like that, please let me know. That that way I can show it the proper love and affection that it so rightly deserves. And of course, if you see me, ca if you catch, if you see, uh, I should say, if you catch me passing like a, a short print or a number card or something like that, please let me know. You know, and I'll go back and I'll check it out for show. I do owe you at least that. But uh, for the most part, I am going to keep it moving. Because we are on a schedule, peeps. Think all these things are short prints, maybe? With a little the little variation there in the bottom. Nikki Delmonico of the White Sox. It's numbered the last two numbers are 45. So it's probably a short print. Of all the times to use some music, now would be the time. But I can't play any music right now. An Austin Hayes rookie card. That might be a short print for the O's. Last two numbers are 45, so I think it might be a short print. Again, what I heard, 43 to 45 uh, are short prints. Again, that's just that's just what I hear in the streets. That's what the streets been telling me. Can't believe Stanton don't play for us no more. That's a that's a shame. I shouldn't be surprised though. It is the uh, the Dolphins after all. This guy don't play for us no more. We freaking we freaking got rid of everybody, man. Jose Quintana, the Cubs foil.
Lonzo Ball rap time. How about uh, you guys check out ribcitycards.com, and if you like what you see and you've never made a purchase on our website, register for an account and save yourself $15 once you register for an account. That code will get emailed to you. It's a good deal. That's a good deal. It's just an insert. No, it's a base. Rafael Davis. Last four numbers are 45. I think that's a short print. For the Red Sox, Davis. I'm going to put some of this stuff away here. I can pair with the Monster Box, baby. Alright. I think this is a gold one here. Yeah, I caught you now. Uh, Jackson Stevens of the Reds, number two, uh, 2018. It's kind of crazy. Are you for real, Dan? There's some really nasty stuff in here, dude. Especially in those silver packs. There's some really nice stuff in those silver packs. I think this might be a Jack Flaherty for the Cardinals. Oh, you're stationed there, which means you, you're serving in the military, Dan? Is this true? Clayton Kershaw, the Dodgers foil. Thank you for your service, Dan. Get that auto last night. All right, so that's it for one box. All right, got that done. Put this stuff away. Alright, so it's like I said, folks. If I catch them, I catch them. Otherwise, I'm separating the base, inserts, and rookies. So my sorters can then go through those. And make sure to pull out the short prints and whatnot. Sleeve them up, top load them, all that business. All right, that's one box down. That was just one box. And keep in mind, guys, I got a full case of this stuff. Uh, and if you buy a team, you're going to get a silver pack. Uh, and what's in the silver packs, you ask? Well, there's actually some really cool stuff in them. Uh, the silver packs that came with the hobby cases are these bad boys right here. The hobby exclusive series one. Uh, silver packs there's four cards in a pack I opened up two and uh, this is just some of the stuff that came out of it really cool looking cards very nice 
hit a Bellinger in there. I saw this thing on eBay for like 10 bucks, and a Mark McGuire number to 99 here. And I'm giving a, I'm giving away these packs, people. I'm giving away these packs. All you have to do is buy into the store break we have at RipCityCards.com. Buy a team, and you're gonna get one pack. If you're nice, I may even give you two. So let's go ahead and get that ripped. What about eBay? What about eBay? eBay gets enough love as it is. You guys get to dictate the pricing on that. Y'all you, 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 good. eBay is good. Only offering the foil packs at RipCityCards.com, peeps. Gotta get the store moving. Not to mention, you do save $15 off your first website purchase. If you've never made a website purchase, all you have to do, register for an account, and the code will get emailed to you. Yeah, that was only one box. That was only one box we did we just did. So could you imagine how long this would take if I went through every single card? It would take forever. Almost done. All right, let's see if the second pack goes. 
a little bit faster. Well, to uh, ruin the surprise, no auto in this pack. At least, I don't think we will. Because here's the relic. Carlos Martinez of the Cardinals with a napkin. All right. Let's see what we have here. Luis Severino of the Yankees. I believe that's a short print. Ozzy Albies of the Braves, which I believe to be a short print. Francisco Lindor for the Indians. I think that's a short print. Willie Calhoun, Rangers. Which I believe is a short print. So anybody out there watching, and if you're familiar, what exactly what is a short print? I was told if it ends in 43, 44, or 45, it's a short print. Is this true? Have I been fed false information? Like this one would be considered a short print. Chris Davis of the A's. I do like the cards. You know, with this, with this product, it's really all about the pictures, the variations, the short prints. Because uh, it's incredibly tough to get an autograph in this. Incredibly tough. Now I have to random those point and pairs. Uh, this will be a gold to 2018. Well, it's not really a gold. Number to 2018, uh, Rowdy Red or Reed or whatever for the Nationals.
Francisco Mejia, Indians. Just 43 and 44. Gotcha, Bryson. Well, you work at Com C, so you know what's up. So those 45s were uh, hashtag fake news. So 43 and 44 is one I'm, I'm going to be looking after now. So I just sleeved up a bunch of stuff that my, uh, my sorter could have been doing. Right, so that's going to save me some time. A Luis Severino foil for the Yankees. trying to catch them see if they're short prints or not just guessing based off the picture in the front but yeah that's not gonna happen and some of these you know that's because just going off the pictures and see if I can catch it I used to think this was a short print but it ends in 45 is just an insert For the Orioles, Adam Jones, the foil. Let's check the store, see where we're at. Nothing in the store. Come on, guys. Show the store some love. I got a full case of this in the store, peeps. And don't forget, I'm giving away silver packs when you buy a team. Each team you buy, I'll give you a silver pack. There's some sick stuff in there, potentially. So hop to it, peeps. Hop to it. the first time it feels like the very first day ah short prints end in 43 super short prints in 44 got it duly noted well Juan I'm pretty much just separating the cards right now that has to get random because there's two different teams. Uh, what I have here are rookies. What I have here are what I consider to be the base set. And this are inserts. Uh, so I'm separating it to make my sorter's life a bit easier. So she can go through them and uh, 
you know, sleeve and top load any of the short prints and shoot, uh, super short prints and things like that. That'll be a short print for show. The black and white action. For Giancarlo Stanton of the Marlins, the negative. It's not, doesn't, doesn't have the numbering of a short print, but you know, it is black and white. Doki. Got Jackie Bradley Jr. of the Red Sox foil. Are you in this break one? You look like you did say you're new to the room. So welcome, my dude. But I am curious, are you in this eBay break by any chance? Or, you know, how, how else did you you stumble up into this best-kept secret known as Rip City Cards? You won the Dodgers. Oh, man. Good luck to you, my dude. I hope you hit big in this. Well, listen, I got to I gotta do my due diligence, man. You know, we also have breaks on our website, ripcitycards.com. And uh, we are offering a full case break of this product. A full case break. Where with your team purchase, you are going to receive a silver pack from Series 1. The hobby exclusive silver packs. Only available at RipCityCards.com. And uh, not to mention, you do save $15 off your first purchase once you register for an account. Alright, so I'm almost done with the second box here. Bryson, the real MVP, giving everybody knowledge and stuff. Well, Juan, good luck to you in this break, man, with the Dodgers. But like I said, if you want to, if you want to give a shot at a full case break, check out RipCityCards.com. That's where we have our full case breaks listed. Uh, you'll hardly ever see full cases listed on eBay from us. So uh, definitely check out our website. Shipping and handling already included in the spot price. All we have to do is wait for all teams to sell, and then we rip that thing. We still need some help on that, guys. So uh, if you want to help, that would be much, much appreciated. And that's why I'm giving away some silver packs, if you do. Uh, that'll be numbered to 2018. Mark Reynolds of the Rockies. some base cards here all right let's put this stuff away so only two boxes down To box three. Oh boy.
Box two was half the time of box one. I know. Because in box one, I was I was tr paying way more attention than I probably, I probably should. So moving forward, I think I'm just gonna go a little bit a little bit quicker on it. I'm still gonna show everything. But uh, now that I know exactly what the short prints are, unless one of you catches it, I'm just going to go through it, really. Because it's going to take forever if I keep looking at the back of the card trying to figure out what's a short print and what's not. Because that's the only way to tell is by looking at the back of the card. Or if you know for a fact that it's a short print based on what it looks like. That's why I'm you know, pretty much checking out the chat every now and then. Making uh, making sure people are are into it, letting me know, hey Jesse, you passed this, or you know, hey that was a short print. You know, if you guys catch it, I'll go back, I'll check it out, and boom, I'll give it the love and respect and adoration that it deserves. But uh, yeah, I think I'm just gonna kind of plow through it. And we are on a schedule. I'm only on the third box. I got another three boxes to go. I got a break coming up in 10 minutes, so to avoid a huge fucking bonanza, I'm just going to go through a little bit quicker. But if you want to see me struggle and bitch and moan in a full caser, oh, guess what? We do got a full caser listed at RipCityCards.com. Check us out. Check the store, see what's going on there. Oh man, my man Kyle going in. So it looks like Mavericks gone in status number two. I got Jets, Steelers, and Niners going in Vertex on our websites. Niners, Steelers, Jets, and the Hornets also in number two status. Very nice. All right, so we have nine teams left in status, full case number two. And 18 in Vertex Football, number one, on our website. Let's get it done, Dan. Let's get it done. And uh, while we're at it, you guys, check out RipCityCards.com. Like I said, I got a full case break of this stuff, you guys. I still got 24 teams left. And like I said, buy a team and you get a free silver pack along with your team purchase and any and all hits that come out of that. For your team, of course. So let's 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 keep it rolling here, peeps. Let's keep it rolling. You know, this is an eBay break. This is indeed an eBay break, but we also have store breaks. You know, keep in mind this is a half caser. So some of you guys kind of overpaid, if I'm being honest. You could have got into a you know, could have got into a full caser for a, for for a smidge more. But you would have doubled your possibilities in a full caser. So uh, I'm, I'm just saying, I think it's a it's a better route to go in a full case action. But if you want to continue doing full cases, hey, fine by me. I'm just trying to just trying to extend a nice little deal to you. And also keep in mind, aside from doing full case breaks on our store, uh, we also offer. $15 off of your first website purchase. All you have to do is go to RipCityCards.com, click login at the top right of the screen, then click register, fill everything out, and we'll automatically email you a code to save you $15 on your first ever website purchase. That code is only good at RipCityCards.com. All right?
Come on, seriously? All right, we've hit two relics so far. An autograph would be nice to take a look at, don't you think? All right, so I'm not even going to bother, like, flipping them right side up either. Save even more time here. You got um, uh, Travis the Arnand for the Mets. That's number to 2018. That's a little crazy. All right. What does it even matter? Hmm. Yeah, you feel me? Like, what's up with that? Numbering it so high, man. Elvis Andrus of the Rangers foil. Kyle E, thank you for going balls deep in the store, man, buying a bunch of stuff. We'll get to it right after this break. Judge number to 299 for the Yankees. That's got to be nice. There you go, Yanks. All rise for the Judge Man. Damn, what you you collect only baseball? Or what else are you into? Yet another patch. 
This time for the Cubs to 50. Javi Baez. Two color passion for the Cubs. Check the store real quick. <sighs> All right, let me grab some water. I guess it is a smoothie. Dan, really, Dan. Wow. Talk about commitment. I don't know if I could ever do that to my dolphins. I actually know that'd be kind of easy. Dolphins suck. Inserts. You know, I wish they made this thing easier to figure out as far as like short prints from my dumb ass. Just put it in the front short print. Oh, okay, it's a short print. It says short print. My Marlins are gonna suck major ass this year. But hopefully, we're building to something in the future. What that is, I have no clue. But uh, in Jeter, we trust right now. In Jeter, we trust right now. Well, so you weren't even rooting for the Titans once they made it to the playoffs? We're talking about the play playoffs? No, this will be numbered. Nolan Arenado. For the Rockies, numbered to 2018. My peeps put me on game. So shout outs to the peeps in the room for always helping your boy out. Hello darkness, my old friend. Do, 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 do. Really need to uh, figure out a way to get some music playing here while I do this uh, JD Davis rookie there got a Salvador Perez foil for the Royals uh, well they shut the videos down if you're trying to watch the live stream Steve-O they shut the videos down uh, because I play music and because we don't have the licensing for music uh, it takes the live stream down. And that's also another reason why you don't hear any music right now. Because if I did have music playing, they would take the video down. And then nobody would be able to see the breaks. And then people would be all like, oh, that guy's a crook. That guy's a fucking scumbag. That guy's a piece of shit. That guy's a liar. That guy's fake news. Boo! Uh, so you can see it, it is a slippery, slippery slope. One uh, that I, I, I do not want to go on. So you got to deal with the, the smooth, smooth sounds of me breathing. Steve-O, are you in this break, dude? I just want to know so I can spread the mojo, you know what I'm saying? If you haven't already said something in the chat, guys, come through, say hi. Spread the good mojo. And uh, watch Uncle Jesse hit you something nice. Otherwise, if I mean, if you want to be a creep, then you know, keep on creeping, creep. I'm just gonna tell you right now, it's not good karma to be a creep. I'm just saying, you know, you come through the chat and you make a request. There's a, there's a, there's a, there's a chance it can happen. There is a chance it can happen. Howie Kendrick of the Nationals with a foil. So Dan didn't even root for the Titans once they made the playoffs. Wow. Cold-blooded. Mm. 
All right, about to be halfway through. What to do, uh, freaking nature? It feels like the first time. It feels like the very that song stuck in my head. I'm sorry. All right, done with the third box. I will say this: we're on pace to to do this in like an hour and a half, which is better than the two hours it took me last night. So there's that. You just got back from Publix. You got a chicken tender sub? Nice. You know, I feel I feel for the people that, that have never experienced a sub from Publix. It's the greatest thing ever. You should have a soft spot for your for the Houston teams though, uh Dan. It's your old stomping grounds, man. Uh, the illusions is yeah, it's already eight oh four. So I mean, you know, I think it's not gonna happen, Steve. -o. But it will. I mean, it's gonna happen for sure. Just not at eight o'clock. It'll go uh, once I'm done with this. Obviously, take a swig of my juice. That's kind of it's kind of intense. Trying to live that healthy lifestyle. Really? All I needed was... I should have put some pineapple in that. And then uh, that, that I would have been... Fuego! Pineapple's that natural... Unnatural sweetener. So it just makes things more delicious. Uh, a couple more hours for this to break. I sure hope not. I mean, the last box I did it fairly quickly. And I'm going to continue to do that. You know, what takes me forever is the fact that I have to, you know, some of these cards, like, I'll open one pack. Let's see if it does it. You see how some of the cards aren't even, like, right side up? So, you know, if I take the time to put everything up and blue, and I, that was one pack. Imagine me doing that for a fucking half case. I did yesterday. It took me two, two something hours or so. Not doing that anymore. I am showing off everything. But yeah. What up, Todd? How you doing, bro? Are you in this break? I mean, everything, everything's, good. well, just open everything. Stack pack, that's no good. Pack stacking is not good. I try to avoid pack stacking as much as possible. Because it, it just it, it brings chaos. And I, I have a, I have a system right now. I got you, Todd. I will be doing illusions football right after this break, my dude. As you can tell, I am in the middle of a different break. Smack dab in the middle. I got two more boxes of this to go. I'll be honest, this does take a, a long time. So I'm probably, probably going to be at this for another half hour. Uh, but once this is done, Illusions is happening. All right, Todd? Let me download my uh, my file again here. I do want to stay uh, up to date. JD, there are nine spots left right now in status. We have the Bucks, Lakers, Nuggets, Pelicans, Sixers, Suns, Thunder, Warriors, and the Wizards available. Jason, you know it's not going to take me another hour, man. Really, Dan? I just I read your your your, ID, your thing there. 
you met more and moon at the airport and you talk some shit because his bro because your brother played his son in football wow talk about a small world download yet or what hey it did sweet all right cool all right just check the store nothing else he seems like a cool dude now Dan Marino on the other hand I hear is a huge asshole You know, so if I if I ever saw Marino in the streets, I would I would I would be inclined to walk up to him and be like Mr. Marino or something like that, you know? Cause it's fucking Dan Marino. But I don't know, man. I've I've heard some stories about the guy. I hear he's uh not a nice dude. But what the fuck do I know? For all I know, I'll be like, yo, and he'll be like, yo. And then we'll be like, yo! And then uh, we'll go have a beer or something, all all on his, all at his expense. Or at least that's how uh, I see things, anyway. All right, let's uh, try to go through this at a reasonable pace here. What are you separating? I'm separating the base, inserts, and rookies. Got a Christian Yelich foil for the Marlins. No, I'm, dude, I'm telling you, that's just word around town. And, you know, we do, I do live in Miami, Florida, uh, as does Dan the Man Marino. And, man, it's, it's, dude, I'm telling you, people around town. If, if enough people are saying it, it's, it's got to not be a coincidence. You know what I mean? There's got to be some kind of truth to it. And, you know, f and then everyone I've talked to that, that has met the dude wishes they did it. Because he's he just treated them like shit, apparently. Now, I, li I like to give people the benefit of the doubt. So, you know, I'm, I'm giving Dan all the benefit of the doubt. I'm like, oh, well, you, know, he, you know, you probably got him at a bad time, you know. He probably he probably met his quota of autographs for the day, blah blah blah. But if Dan Marino ever tried to punch me in the face, he's gonna meet a side of me that nobody wants to see, and then he and then he'd sue me. Eric Hosmer of the Royals, that's number twenty eighteen. I want a celebrity to punch me in the face. What I'm suing, dog. I'm suing you, and you breaking me off, because I know you got it. Is that wrong? Oh, see, the, the pace is picking up. The pace is picking up. You feel me, Dan? That's. I'm just again. I can't give you firsthand experience because I've never personally met the man. But people that I've met or people that I know that have met him, they all, literally all, say the same thing. Oh, the guy's an asshole. The guy is not nice. Like damn, bro. It's like telling me Santa don't exist. All right, something tells me this is a short print. And I'm right. Victor Robles of the Nationals. You want to know how I know? Because, you know, it just, I've never seen that, before, that, that picture before. 
So, I, you know, I put two and two together. After a while, you see enough of these cards and, and you can more or less tell if it's a variation or a short print or something. Anthony Rizzo, foil for the Cubs. Dan Marino punches Superfan in the face. Gets sued for $10 million. Now bankrupt. I wouldn't even ask for that much money. I lied. I would ask for some money. But maybe not $10 million, But I definitely ask for a cool... Give me a cool $2, 3000000 million for punching me in the face, Dan Marino. I'll let you punch me a, a couple times in the face. Shit, you wanna you wanna you wanna soccer kick me in the face? Go for it, bro. Just pay for all my medical expenses, and then give me like two three million for my uh, my, my my pain and suffering, and, and we and we cool. To fifty Ryan Healy for the A's. Very nice. Who reads the Miami Herald anyways, Jason? <laughs> there, you know now nowadays people are probably uh, reading that article. On their iPad or whatever. You know, I never understood the uh, the hype over tablets. It's it's just a it's it's a big ass it's a big ass smartphone. Like I I I, I don't know I don't get it. Damn it! See, I thought it was gonna be cool. Like, oh look, bro, I got another short print. Yeah, not the not the case. You win some, you lose some. All right, we're moving here. We're moving here. All right. I I would not find Dan Marino. I would not fight Dan Marino. My childhood, my childhood idol. I could never fight Dan Marino, unless I'm pushed into the situation. Then then it's like you say, Jason. I'm going to have to do him Kimbo Slice style. I'm going to have that boy leaking with his eye hanging out. And then he's going to be like, oh, we, we cool, dog. We cool, we good, we good, we good. Dude, that video is heinous, man. And you want to know what's even crazier? Is I literally lived down the street from that house. Uh, that they used to do all those fights at. Like, literally my house is down the street. From those Kimbo backyard brawls. You know, people people didn't believe me until they actually came over to my house. And they're like, oh shit, that's where the... Yep, they, yeah, I know, I know. That's where Kimbo uh, fought that one dude. And his eye came out. Yep, I know. I've never actually met him, though. I've never actually met Kimbo. But I did meet the dude that he fought. Not the dude that's eye was hanging out in that video. I met some other dude he fought. Uh, I don't know if you saw his fight against this dude called Dada5000. Uh, before he passed away, R.I.P. Kimbo. Um, he fought some dude named Dada5000. Uh, and he's, uh, he's the local... I don't want to say he's a hooligan. He's not a hooligan. He's actually a really cool dude. Uh, Got to talk to him a few times. Really cool, down to earth guy. But it was Kim. I forget the guy's name. Well, his name is Dada Five Thousand. I don't know his real name, but yeah, Kyle Schwarber of the Cubs with the material card there. Anyways, back to story time. So yeah, I I met the Dada Five Thousand dude before he he fought Kimbo, and uh, he's he seems like a, a straight up dude. You know, cool guy, stand up guy. Um, although he does those backyard fights and stuff. I'm not sure if you guys have seen the document. It, it is on Netflix. If you guys think I'm bullshitting, I never bull, well, I bullshit all the time. Uh, but not when it comes to story time. Uh, the name of the documentary is Dog Fight. D-A-W-G Fight. Uh, and you can catch it on Netflix. It's basically a documentary of backyard fights that, uh, happen here in South Florida. And, uh, yeah, 
Check it out. If you give a fuck. We got Martin Maldonado of the Angels foil action there. That goes here. Well, what's that link to, Jason? They're moving a little bit quicker. Kind of, kind of have to. This stuff takes forever. Oh, the highlights of Dada. Uh, no auto just yet. It's been straight up uh, patch action. Or napkins as we like to call them. And that one material card, you know, the piece of the bat or whatever. But we do have two boxes left to go. I get the feeling that we're going to get hopefully at least one autograph oh dude the highlights of that fight there's really not that many highlights that was one of the worst fights ever just two big ass dudes swinging for the fences each time and they got tired real quick if you've ever been into in a like in a real fight dude fights don't last longer than like five to ten minutes because you get tired bro being in a fight is fucking working out. Yeah, and that fight with Dada and Kimbo, probably one of the worst fights I've ever seen. Those, those dudes were just swinging for the fences, missing each time, and they just got tired real quick. And that's no fun. Jose Reyes of the Mets foil. You know what is fun though? This status. And you want to make it even more fun, kids? Check it. Go to ripcitycards.com, register for an account, save $15 on your first purchase, okay? You can then buy into a full case break of this Top Series 1 baseball. Did I just say full case? Yeah, I did. I did say a full case. And for your team, let's say you buy, for example, the Angels in the full case break I will also give you a silver pack with your team purchase bada bing bada boom but Uncle Jesse I don't know what those cards look like well luckily for you I opened up a few packs and they look really cool you get four per pack and there's some really cool stuff like this Bellinger selling for like 10 bucks on eBay and there's a McGuire to 99 right here Definitely cool looking stuff. There are autographs available in this stuff. There are patches, uh, you know, etc., etc. But it's all random. And I got hella packs to give away. So you buy a team, I give you a silver pack. Simple as that. And also keep in mind, guys, what we have in the store is not a hobby full case. We got a jumbo full case. Difference between jumbo and hobby. In Jumbo, you get two autographs per box on average, as opposed to one auto or relic in the hobby. So get your teams, peeps, and let's fill that thing up so we can rip it. All right. Got this box here. Soften it up, see what we got.
Ronda Rousey's a fucking wrestler now, man. What the hell? Oh, shit. Blake Griffin is playing today for the Pistons? And nobody told me? I'm curious to see what he looks like in a Piston uniform. I thought he was playing Friday for the Pistons. But he playing today. It's Grizzlies Pistons. Make sure I got the audio off. So I can catch the stream. He probably is cold. Being a California boy. Now he's out there in the, in the dirty D. It's so cold in the D. He's made three shots. He's attempted six. He has a game high 13 points. Seven rebounds in the first half. Jason, are you watching the Pistons game? Oh, second half underway. It is a classic song. It's a classic, internet classic. And Dan, use a real one for that one. Uh, how about those Phillies Red Sox? How about them? Uh, nothing yet. I mean, as far as the inserts, I'll be honest with you, Scott. I am not going to sit here and go through every single card. And look at the back and see if it's a short print or not. If I catch it, I catch it. But what I do, I do show every single card. I do show every single card. So if you catch a short print or something, let me know. And uh, I'll give it the proper love and attention and affection that it deserves. Uh, but so far, the only uh, short print that I have found is a Victor Ro uh, Robles uh, short print here for the Nationals. No autographs have come out of this yet. We're hoping to change that. And, uh, you know, we, we do have a full case of this stuff on our website, guys, ZipCityCards.com. Uh, as a matter of fact, it's a full jumbo case. In jumbo, there's about two autographs uh, per box on average. Still get the short print business, of course, from you know from the hobby. Just get an extra auto in there. We are doing a full case break of that on our website, guys. We have 24 teams left on it. Once all teams are sold, we ripping it. Plain and simple. And like I like I always say, in case you don't feel like reading that right there, you can save $15 off your first purchase, peeps. All you have to do is visit RipCityCards.com, register for an account, and you will receive a code saving you $15 off your first purchase. Man, this Grizzlies Pistons game, I just started watching this for like two minutes, and it is tough to watch. Blake Griffin in the post, doing what he do. That's that's pretty much what he's going to bring to the Pistons is instant offense, but a low-key defensive liability. Blake got 18 points, 7 rebounds, 2 assists. And his first game as a piston. He's looking a little lost out there. Which is to be expected. You know, first game with a new team.
All right. Fifth box. Let's go through this thing here. So I'm going to continue to separate inserts in the base set and the rookies. And if you guys catch any short prints, please let me know. And like I said, I'll show them the, the tender love and affection they deserve. This is a foil for Mookie Betts of the Red Sox. There's like two foils per box kind of deal. That Renfro. Oh. Yes, I try to guess to see if I can catch him. To no avail. That's a rookie. That's a rookie too. I did catch one. I did catch the Robles. So, pat on the back for that one. A little number on this. Clayne Kershaw of the Dodgers. That is numbered to 2018. Right, uh, Scott. That's that's pretty much why this stuff does take some time. And then after a while, just like, fuck it. Because the, the code the code number here, you can't see it. Because the camera can't focus right now. But yeah, the last two numbers. If it's 43, it's a short print. If it's 44, it's a super short print. Uh, but yeah, you know, I, I try to guess uh, if I if I see a variation of it that I haven't seen before, I'm like, oh shit, I think that's a short print, and then I verify it with the number in the back. But you are correct, yeah. Usually, if they're in warm ups, you know, it's it's a short print. You know, uh, sidebar, the Pistons dancers are uh, kind of terrible, kind of terrible. I took a glance over, and I saw their roster, and uh, yeah, they probably just shouldn't have dancers this year. I guess because it's so cold in the D, you know, they can't go outside to get the sun and stuff, you know. Get that vitamin D, you know what I'm saying? I don't know. Pretty much talking shit to get through this here. I haven't seen that one. Yeah, I've, I've ripped open about two cases of this. I lied. This would be one case that I've done. And, you know, I pretty much just try to uh, figure it out or not. See, this one's not a short print, but it is numbered to 50. Carlos Correa of the Astros. What else we got? So, yeah, I'm separating what I believe to be the base inserts and the rookie sets. And then my sorters go through those. They look at the codes and they separate all short prints, super short prints, and top load them and all that stuff. Uh... But for breaking purposes here, um, sh I am showing everything. I mean, listen, if I, if I was to go and put every single card right side up, you know what I mean? Like, look at this. It's fucking ridiculous. It would take me hours, literally hours, to do this. And I know you don't want to waste your time doing all that, so I'm not going to do that. But, I, I, you know, of course, I am showing off everything. If you see a short print, please let me know. And uh, I will show it the love and affection it, it so badly needs and deserves. You know, it didn't get hugged enough as a child. So we, we got to give it some L-O-V-E. It's like a weird funky color on that. I guess not. Real Muto, please don't leave. Uh, you know what? It's not even up to you. 
management's just fucking shipping everybody out. I'm really curious to see what the, the Marlins are going to look like next year. Or this upcoming season, I should say. I don't think they're going to be competitive, but we'll see. Oh, trust me, Scott. I won't. Trust me. I will not. Foil for Yuli Gurriel of the Astros. How about the Astros, man? Shout outs to the Astros for winning the World Series. And shout outs to the Yankees to making it to the World Series. I don't think anybody expected the Yanks to make it to the World Series. Aaron Judge had a hell of a rookie season. Who's going to be this year's Aaron Rudge? Aaron Rudge. That's a new one. Yeah, who's going to be this year's Aaron Rudge, huh? <laughs> Man, Blake Griffin really plays no defense. Stan Van Gundy ain't gonna like that. The Clippers should have never signed them to that ridiculous contract in the first place. But, you know, it's the Clippers. They what what do they know? Nothing actually. Well, good news is uh, we're almost done. Uh, bad news, uh, where the fuck is the autograph? That's what I want to know. Giancarlo and Aaron Judge on the same team. Oh, my God. Rice Hoskins. I remember for a while, the search was, was, was intense for this dude. Of the Phillies, Rice Hoskins. That's number to 2018. That's kind of whack. Well, spoiler alert, no auto in this box. But we did, uh, did get a napkin for Yadier Molina of the Cardinals. The material card. Actually... I think I had a box in last night's half caser where there was a relic and an auto. Uh, so here's hoping for something nice. $20 for a Hoskins gold? Like this one? I mean, I guess you can consider that gold. I mean, I'm just asking. For this thing right here? Scott? Wow. I'm I'm doing my best, Bryson. I am doing my best. Damn. Scott? That's kind of nuts, really. The thing's numbered to 2018 and it's going for some a little moolah.
We got Kendris Morales for the Blue Jays there, all shiny. The Victor Robles going to 25 and up. Dang. Where the super short prints at? And some of these I just I have to check because I've never seen the picture before. So I just make assumptions. Anyways, thank you, Bryson. You're too kind. Anyways. Well, I will say this. These silver packs have, like, really fucking nice shit. I've seen some of these cards go for some moolah. For example, this Bellinger i seen listed for, like, $10, $15 on eBay earlier today. Uh, some dude hit a, a Chris Bryant autograph from these silver packs. And that thing was selling for, uh, for a nice little chunk of change. And if you, if you want to, uh, well, no, uh, smart-ass Jason... Uh, it'll be done in the next 10 minutes. We got a nice room count, baby. We got a nice room count. How about we, get, we keep that chat moving along, baby? Putting all this stuff uh, away because, as you can see, <laughs> it'll be a clusterfuck. But if you want to get your hands on these silver packs... All right, I'm going to give you one with your team purchase, but only at RipCityCards.com. Sorry, eBay. Juno get these. Not for me, anyway. Go to RipCityCards.com. Buy a team in 2018 Topps Baseball Series 1 Jumbo Full Case PYT number 1, and I will give you a pack, a silver pack, along with your team purchase. Buy two teams, I'll give you two packs. Buy three teams, I'll give you three packs. So on and so forth. Now keep in mind, this is a half caser. On our website, we do full cases, guys and gals. So check out our website, ripcitycards.com. It's right there. And also keep in mind, you do save $15 on your very first website purchase. All you got to do is register for an account. You are correct, Juan. You are correct. That is me smoking that good shit. A uh, 10 hour break on the full caser. Nah, there ain't gonna be no break, man. You guys feel the full case, or I'm ripping that thing tonight, plain and simple. You guys know how Uncle Jesse gets down? I don't care if it's three, four, five, six, seven in the morning. We feel it. I'm ripping it, plain and simple. What it do, Andrew? So, guys, show some love to that 2018 jumbo full case of Series 1 baseball. If you're watching this, you're probably interested in a full case. Check out the website. Well, Andrew, uh, right now I'm pushing the 2018 Top Series 1 Jumbo case we have in the store. But if you also check the store out, man, we got 19s left in Status Basketball full case. We still got the Lakers available. Still got the Sixers available. The Warriors are still up there. Still got some good teams in that. Uh, and I'm also running a promotion where if you buy a team in Top Series 1 Jumbo, full case or on our website, I am going to give you a silver pack. All right? Also, if you buy into Flawless Baseball and you go hitless, I'll give you a $100 break credit. Or at least I'll try to. I'll throw you in a randomizer for it. And if you go hitless in a full case of Immaculate Football... Same thing. I'll put you in a randomizer. You and all the other folks that unfortunately went hitless. And you have a chance to win $100 in break credit. Hey. I lied. There's one cute chick on the Pistons dancing squad. Uh, this is new baseball, Andrew. This is new baseball. 
and uh, and I think you'll like it, man. There's uh, in this stuff, it's all about the the short prints, the variations, and whatnot. Last box mojo. And then I'm moving on to illusions right after this is done. Let's see where we're at in the store with these store breaks. Nowhere! Oh damn, that's not good. Come on guys. Check out ribcitycards.com. I know you're gonna like what you see. So get up in there, baby. Get up in there. Good luck, guys. Last box mojo. Hopefully, we see an autograph here. Or something stupid crazy. Like a 101 or something. Uh, J.D. Davis of the Astros. I guess I guess we're calling these golds. Number to 2018. Again, separating inserts, base, and rookies. for my sorters make their life a little easier that's a rookie that has to uh, get a uh, random I can't help myself to check some of these cards. Like some of them I just I've never seen the picture before. Like those two back to back I've never seen before. What the hell is that? Trey Turner of the Nationals, number to 25, hey, nice, I was wondering when like a, a, a low number parallel would come out to play, and there we go, decent, and so uh, Nationals put in work, they have uh, the Robles short print, and now this Trey Turner to 25, parallel still have yet to see an autograph though still have yet to see an autograph would like to see that Colton Wong with the foil for the Cardinals sorry I, I just cannot help myself with some of these
Dan, I probably asked you a million times, but you got the Nationals? If so, New Guy Mojo is real. This uh, this has to be, like, numbered. Zach uh, Davies of the Brewers, numbered to 67. Numbers coming out to play now. In the last box. Better late than never. Where's the auto, though? And make it a 101 or something super awesome. George Springer of the Astros with a foil. Oh, very nice, Dan. Very nice. Glad you're getting nice things. You deserve it. Let's see if we can spread the love into other peeps here. They're knocking on the fucking door. She's gonna be real quiet. I don't wanna answer the door. Nothing so far. Come on. Come on. Trying to keep some organization going here. All right. Come on. Show me something nice. Greg Holland of the Rockies foil. But you keep knocking on the door all you want. I am not going to answer. Fucking working right now, bitch. So keep it keep knocking on the door. I'm not gonna answer the fucking door. Uh what's the well these are rookies. These are nuts. That's a rookie. There's the auto. Oh, so okay. So this was a Reds case, clearly. Oh, that's what it is, Ra Ra. Mm, I knew it. There's the auto. Jackson Stevens of the Reds with the autograph. Not numbered. But there's the auto. So this was a Reds case. Because the other autograph in it was a Barry Larkin autograph to five. So Reds gonna be happy what else we got what else we got 
Well, there's still a chance to, to hit like a one on one mojo or something, right? Auto better than Babe Ruth. This guy. How you been, Rara? Your heater still working? I don't. I don't want you out there in the cold, man. You, you come stay with Uncle Jesse. here good to hear good to hear Ra Ra nobody wants a cold Ra Ra in the streets that's no bueno uh, Ryan Zimmerman of the Nationals number to 2018 it for this an hour and a half later well I am shorting my time I am shorting the time yesterday it took like two hours and some change today I was like yeah that's not gonna happen again you know I fell asleep like twice during this break did my taxes cool cool uh, Daniel uh, Coulombe or something like that for the A's refractor action right there There it is. Boom. Break. Done. Over with. Uh, but not completely. Because we still have to do this little uh, random here. Had a couple cards with uh, multiple teams on it. Two teams to be specific. And uh, they need to be randomed. So I got this. Uh, the Rizzo and the Harper. Cubs Nationals and then the Twins Royals business here. So this is going to be pretty simple. If I get an odd number on the die roll, it goes to the left team. Even number, right team. Odd left, even right. Here we go. Got the even number two, so it's going to go to the right team. So these cards are going to the Nationals. And these cards going to the Royals. Make a note of that from my sorters. You know, I know you guys are probably thinking, oh my god, who cares about that, bro? You'd be surprised. You would be surprised. Oh my god, you didn't send me one base card! <sighs> well, it clearly says that we don't send one. <laughs> Alright, yeah, okay, whatever. Uh, it's almost over, Jason. You came just in time for the fun part. The uh, the recap. Super stupid easy recap. Uh, only one autograph. A few uh, napkins, as I like to call them. The relics. Uh, nope, no silver packs. I, I am only giving away silver packs in these store breaks. So there were a few cards here that were numbered. Well, if you won both teams, if you got the Royals and the Nationals, they're, they're both yours. Oh, wait, you won one of each? So you're, okay, so Dan, you're, if I'm understanding this correctly, you want one of each of these. And then the other one can go to the other team. Is that what I'm understanding? On these? So you want one of each and then the other one can go to the other team. 
is what I understood. Now I am stupid, so please confirm as I go through these things here. Am I breaking 1970s common cards with the eBay breaks? Uh, no. Uh, we are giving them away though for winning, a, you know, the team or whatever. But I ain't doing that shit on the hell no. Nah. You get that when you get that. It'll be it'll be like a Santa Claus deal, you know. Oh shit! Look what came in the mail today. I was not expecting that. Oh yeah, sweet. Cut the card in half. That sounds like a plan. I'll make sure to cut all your cards in half, Triple B. You got it, dude. You want one national and one royal. Yeah, that's pretty much what I understood. So, it'll get done. I just had a funny way of saying it. As usual. Now, if you were expecting to get silver packs, <laughs> I regret to inform you, we ain't giving them away. Well, actually, we are. The only way to get these silver packs is to go to RipCityCards.com and to buy into our 2018 Tops Baseball Series 1 Jumbo Full Caser. Sorry, eBay. You guys get enough love as it is. Got to show the store some love, too. So, uh, I guess this is the recap, if you will. There was a negative for Giancarlo Stanton on the Marlins. It's not a short print or nothing, but I can only assume it's worth some moolah. And worthy to note. Uh, all these bad boys are numbered to 2018. Yeah, I know. That's kind of weird. Zimmerman Nationals, Moncada White Sox, uh, Stevens Reds. Uh, for the Nationals, Roddy Red or Reed, whatever. Uh, Travis DeArnand, or however you say that for the Mets. Mark Reynolds, Nolan Arenado, Rockies, Eric Hosmer, Royals, uh, Clayton Kershaw, Dodgers, Rice Hoskins, Phillies, J.D. Davis, Astros, uh, Ryan Healy to 50 for the A's, uh, Carlos Correa to 50 for the Astros, Zach Davies of the Brewers numbered to 67, and Aaron Judge to 299 for the Yankees. There was a short print of Victor Robles. Last two numbers are 4-3, so you know it's real. We also had Yadier Molina Cardinals napkin. Kyle Schwarber Cubs, piece of the bat. Javier Baez, two-color relic Cubs. Carlos Martinez Cardinals napkin. And a two-color napkin of Gary Sanchez for the Yankees. We also had... Trey Turner of the Nationals. That parallel is number 20 out of 25. That's kind of cool. And the autograph. Only one in this half caser. Jackson Stevens of the Reds. Base on card auto. Not numbered, but it is autographed. On card. Very nice. Jackson Stevens in this half. And uh, the other Reds player in the other half. Barry Larkin, I believe. So this was a Reds case. And that was the break, guys. 2018 Series 1 Hobby Baseball Half Case Number 2 eBay Style. Thank you all very much. We'll get that right out to you.